Hello and welcome to HCL e-learning module. In this module, we are going to discuss about printers. So we all know about the importance of a printer in our IT infrastructure. So we'll dig more into that and I plan to cover the following topics during the session. First one is types of printer and next difference between impact and non-impact printers and the last major parts of printers. So let's jump in. Printers are mainly divided into two types. One is impact printer and another one is non-impact printers. If you're taking any printer, there are a lot of mechanical assemblies inside. Some parts are taking care of paper movement inside and outside from the printer. And some parts are taking care of sensing some things like whether the cover is open or not and whether the paper is moving inside or not. So these all are sensor mechanisms. Next main part is printing mechanism which will take care about printing on a paper. So this impact printer and non-impact printer is mainly classified because of this printing mechanism how it works. So in impact printer I can say while printing on a paper the printing mechanism will touch on the paper. So in non-impact printer while printing the printing mechanism will not touch on the paper. So that is what is a major difference between impact printer and a non-impact printer. So as you can see in the PPT there are a lot of pictures I have included and each picture is representing different types of printers. Nowadays a lot of printers are available in the market depending on the customer requirement. Some customers may require only black and white copies so they may go for a dot matrix printers and mostly bank customers may require some printers which can print on passbook so that is passbook printer some customers may require a higher end printer which can print continuously with high speed so i can say it's a line printer some printers will use inks which can spray on the paper while printing so that is inkjet printers and some printers which will use a laser technology for printing i can say it's a laser jet printer so all these printers will come under either impact printers or non-impact printers. I can say dot matrix printer, high speed dot matrix printer, passbook printer, line printers are coming under impact printer category. Laser jet printers and inkjet printers are coming under non-impact printer category. Why? Because while printing, the printing mechanism will not touch directly on the paper. Now we can see the speed of a printer. So why we need speed? Definitely the question will come why we need to measure speed of a printer, right? And I can say most of the customers are nowadays looking this fact. How fast my printer can give printouts? So these I can measure in three ways as presentation says. One is CPS that is character per second. And I am measuring the speed of a printer in character per second. How many characters it can print in a second? Or I can measure in LPM, that is line per minute, how many lines it can print in a minute or pages per minute. That means how many pages it can print in. The small end printers like dot matrix printers and all will measure the speed in character per second. If you are measuring speed of a higher end printer like a line printers and all, we will measure speed in line per minute or pages per minute. During our initial discussion, I told the major difference between an impact printer and a non-impact printer. So we will dig into deep here. Impact printer, as slide says, the printing mechanism will touch on the paper and non-impact printer, the printing mechanism will not touch on the paper. And while printing, the impact printer will make much noise. If you enter into some offices, from a corner you can hear a lot of noise like sounds. Mostly they may be using a dot matrix printer. That is impact printer will make some noise during the printing. And non-impact printer comparing to impact printer, the noise which is producing during the printing, it will be very less. And impact printer will give a low quality printing and non-impact printer will give a high quality printing. Mostly for high quality printing we will use for laser jet printers and you can see Xerox or Toshiba now the leading OEMs in the Indian market. Most of our offices may have these higher end laser jet printers which will give a, which will give a good quality printouts. 
impact printer it is slow in printing and the non impact printer it is fast in printing this generically i can say but i will not agree in all the cases i can say line matrix printer is fast in printing in the impact printer technology less printing and maintenance cost for impact printer printing and maintenance cost is higher in the case of non impact so as i told in the fast and slow printing i am not completely agreeing with this statement but still i can say most of the non impact printers the maintenance cost is higher than if you are comparing to an impact printer that is dot matrix printer or a high speed dot matrix printer so main parts of printer i can say first one is power supply unit which will give power to the printer and second one is logic card which which is actually a brain of a printer which will decide which part has to function at what time and how it has to be worked and that will decided by the logic card and there are many mechanical assemblies as i mentioned earlier mechanisms for sensors there are mechanisms for paper feeding there are mechanisms for printing there are mechanisms for ribbon movement and etc so main mechanical parts there are paper feeding mechanisms there are sensor mechanisms and there are print head hammer on toner mechanisms and a ribbon mechanism the paper feeding mechanism is mainly taking care of paper movement into the printer and from the printer the sensor mechanism is mainly handling task of sensing whether the print head is heated or not or the cover is open or not or whether the paper is present on the tray how many papers whether it is a multi paper or a single paper everything it can sense the print head hammer or toner assembly is a major part of a printer which will do printing on the paper the ribbon assembly mainly it is present on dot matrix printer or a high speed dot matrix printer or line matrix printer which hammers or print head will fire through the ribbon so that on the ribbon there are ink and that ink will strike on the paper so that we will get the print out so you can see the ribbon assembly firing mechanism in this slide as you can see the characters at the bottom this is how a character will form each character is forming because of many dots and how these dots is coming on a paper that you can see in this slide you can able to see there's a green color that is paper you can able to see my mouse pointer there's a green color that is a paper and the blue color that is ribbon there is a drum on top of drum you place paper and there is a ink present on the ribbon there is a pin it is firing through the ribbon so that we will get one dot on the paper like that many dots will form one character we talked about printers why printers are using and what are the major types of printers that is impact printer and non impact printers and what is the difference between impact and non impact printers and we spoke about what are the parts of printers mainly inside that is sensor mechanisms there are printing mechanism there are ribbon mechanisms there are paper feeding mechanisms and at last we saw how a pin is firing on a paper and how a dot forming i think this quick session was useful for you to build your competency and i would like to thank you for watching